Hello, my name is Andrei Osechuk. I help companies to get value from their investments in Adobe Analytics. I am an Adobe Certified Expert with 9 years experience and provide consulting implementation, data analysis and training services. In this video, you will get to know one of the causes why companies may fail to reach desired ROI. The subject of this video is visitor identification across different domains. This is one of the key priorities for especially international companies that maintain lots of different websites and usually they have many different localizations of their primary corporate site. And visitor identification allows them to accurately track the number of unique visitors across all of their digital properties. In this video I will show you an example of how to verify whether the Experience Cloud ID service, previously called Marketing Cloud ID service, is implemented correctly. Let's have a look. I will be using Audi website and we'll start with the German version. In order to validate how Experience Cloud ID service works, I will need to use Browser Console. And I'm interested in the tab network. I will apply a filter to intercept queries to Adobe Analytics Collection Server and will refresh the page. As you can see on the right hand side, we have a few queries to Analytics Server. Let's have a look at the second one. It goes to Global Report Suite and we will need to check the MID parameter that is set by the Experience Cloud ID service. The value of this parameter stands for Visitor ID. This is how Adobe Analytics will identify unique visitors. The next step we will need to do is to verify that absolutely the same value is set while we are visiting other domains, like for example Swiss domain. Let's remember that this value ends with 9448 and now we will go to Swiss domain. So now let's have a look what value we have here. As you can see the value is different and this will have a negative impact on the reporting since you as a manager or as an analyst will have inflated number of unique visitors. And in the global report suite you may have dozens of different websites and for sure you would like to know total number of unique visitors or uh, size of your audience. And since the identifier is different for different domains for the same visitor, the number of unique visitors will be inflated. And as a result this may negatively impact your uh, decisions. Hope this video was helpful for you and now you know how to verify that the Experience Cloud ID service is implemented correctly. So if you have different values in the mid parameter, then something is working incorrectly. Thanks for watching and if you have questions, comments, please leave them under this video. Thanks.